Hey guys, welcome to Back to Basics from Jazz Tutorials. Today I'm going to show you how to create a cool, vibrant picture using your adjustment layers. Okay, so I've opened a photo here and I'm going to now duplicate the layer by doing Control J. Once I've done Control J, I'm now going to add an adjustment layer of gradient map. Um, that's at the bottom here. I'll zoom in a bit for you to see in a second. Alright, there we go. And then you're going to select a pastel color like these, right here. That right here. Alright, that one right there. And with that, you're going to set it to overlay on that adjustment layer. And you should get something similar to that. Maybe not exactly like that, but something similar. Now we're going to add another adjustment layer above that. Um, we're going to add color balance right there. And now is your chance to play around and see what looks good for you. Um, each photo might have a different effect to this. I'm not sure. For this photo, I chose more like an orange-ish, orange yellowish, reddish kind of color to give it more like a movie kind of theme. I guess you could say. So yeah, just playing around with the midtones, highlights, shadows, um, whatever looks good for you. Um, and it will give it like a vibrant, like it'll bring it, like kind of like brighten it a bit, sort of. Because as you saw in the beginning, it was very kind of like plain. But yeah, it looks pretty cool in that, right? Okay, once we have that all done, you're going to now add a new layer above that. And on that layer, we're now going to add just like some cool like little like... Uh, soft edges to it, I guess you'll say. I don't know if there's a terminology for it, but anyway. Um, make sure you have a 300px soft brush selected right there. And you can use either black or white for this. Um, I'm going to show you both ways of doing it. Um, this is how it's going to look, look with the black. Um, for this photo, it doesn't exactly really look good, so I'm going to go ahead and just try it with the white and see if that looks good. So I'm just going to do Control z to, to just, you know, undo all this stuff here. Control Z. Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to now try with white. Um, so let's see. Yeah, it looks much better already. So yeah, I like it with the white for this photo, but um, I'm sure other photos will look good with um, black as well. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. Um, not much more to it. Um, that's pretty simple, right? Well, hope this helped you guys, and I'll uh, see you in a new video. And yeah, this is my final outcome. Thanks for watching, guys, and please subscribe.